All right, last game against this Nico Bolas, and it looks kind of scary, but what a hand for the last game. Mountain, I don't like seeing, but okay. Full counter with Swamp. Boros. Drop. Pretty good. Pretty good. Drop on the play. Mine's okay though, because that enchanted cell sword. I 100% remember this dying, because I remember thinking how good it would have been. Didn't die. Well, that's pretty good. Because <laughs> now we get to play a jaded cell sword. With treasure. And it gets first strike and hate. Yeah, get in there. <laughs> Pick five. Ouch. Okay. Gain five life and destroy target creature. Yeah. Alright, deal three damage to target creature. Target blocked creature, just like before. Again, I pay that. I play that card all day. You see how that's, that situation was insane? Oh, I remember you now. Yeah, this is real bad. So, knowing what I know now, I would uh, swing both. No. Uh, hmm. Swing one. How do I get you to block? You don't. Dang it. Yeah. Well, you can improvise weaponry, the 2-2, two -two, and then play the slinger with the treasure. that mattered. Alright. Unfortunately, he's got all the removal. Now, I end up winning this because he misplays. He misplays one critical turn. I don't remember exactly what he did. What he did, but... Um, I misplay it as well. So, it's just my misplay was worse that I do not attack with the 5-4 but what if he hits a uh, yeah okay creates a treasure token what if he hits a removal spell which he does a lot with that so and then goes to the 5-4 which is bad yeah two damage not enough So here you can play Rust Monster and hold it back. I think that's the play, honestly. I think I'm gonna get greedy though and play both of these. So, no. What I should have done here, looking at this in hindsight, all I needed to do was play Rust Monster and uh, kill his um, his tutu with burning hands because now I have to use the pump spell that I would need so it's just not very good still play the rest monster you can double block play the valor singer double block You know, 100% should double block here if possible. But he would be at 10 right now. Nah, uh, I'd have a rust monster and a treasure on the board. He could not. He could. He'd draw that and then kill the rust monster. But that's pretty risky. He might not have made that play. Now I'm in a really awkward spot. He's gonna kill my 5 4 for sure. I don't. See, I don't know why. So, yeah, I do. Because then, if I double block, then. 
he kills the 2-3. Nice swing back for 5, he goes to 10. So I don't know. This is the the critical misplay here. That I screwed up. Because it's been 8 years since I played Magic. And I just played Hearthstone. And I just thought first strike damage worked different. Or I forgot that first strike damage happened this way. Also, he draws another removal spell. So for some reason in my head, remember this is like almost 2.30 in the morning. And I just played, um, you know, the nine games of Magic. Um, actually more than that because... There are a few games where it's just, it wasn't interesting, so. So what should have happened was exactly what you're thinking. You know, block, because he's allowing me to go to blockers here, right? He has not fireballed my 2-1, which I wouldn't want to either. So not that big of a deal, but go to blockers, block. First strike damage happens, then burning hands the four one. So I should burning hands now. Then I have a two three, a two three, and a two one first strike. Instead, he plays two things and then you know. It ended up not mattering, but it's a simple misplay that could have been avoided, which is exactly why I love doing the format that I'm doing right now, because this is how I, I really learn what I did wrong and what I could do better. So he's going to scry here. It's fine. We're going to end up just killing the Chaos Channeler, and... Yeah, he's tapped out, so let's kill it now. But we should have a 3-1 here. And then rather than swinging with a Valor Singer, I can swing with First Strike. I mean... Suddenly, he has to double block. I mean, double blocking doesn't even do anything. It's just... It's just really bad for him. If I swing with the First Strike there. That would have been way better. He cannot attack here. There's no attack that's good, so he passes turn. I draw the nuts and kill his dudes. I mean, Meteor Storm is so good. Remember when I was like, why is this getting passed to me? It is pack one. You can start going red immediately, and this is why. So if you see a Meteor Storm anywhere in your pack one, force red. If you see it in pack two, I can see maybe passing it, but even still, if, if you don't have that many second color at that point, you know? So, I don't know. Ended up getting there. That's all that matters, right, in the end. So I hope you are enjoying the series. I am enjoying making it. Your subscription, again, means the world to me, especially with so little uh, amount of subscribers I have. I don't even have 500, so, you know, if you leave a comment, I'm going to see it. If you if you want to suggest something, I'm going to read it. I'm going to interact, so, um, yeah. I got more coming because I, I feel like I got this this set figured out now. Bye for now.